having remote start for your car is probably the best feature ever. I absolutely love it, especially when it's cold outside. I can just start my car, let it warm up while I'm finishing getting ready, and it'll be nice and toasty when I get in. But now, we gotta go get these hairs cut. And here's the after. Very excited about it, because I was looking pretty ragged. And I came home to a very, very nice surprise. I have to show you guys. Kelly bought me some flowers. Aren't they pretty? They smell really good. And she also picked up these Thai lime and chili almonds from Trader Joe's. If you have not had these, they are amazing. Spicy, limey, ah, they're delicious. So now we're gonna spend the rest of our afternoon doing some food prep for the week. If you do your, your prep like on Sunday, even though like it takes up time, it just makes life so much easier during the week and it just, it takes the guessing out of like what you're gonna eat. So it uh, definitely helps like, helps you keep on track if you just prep everything ahead of time. And here we are, several days later. I actually thought about like not using the previous clips and just starting the vlog all over, but I thought, you know what? My life is completely random. I feel like the vlog should be completely random. I feel like that's kind of how my life goes. So anyway, uh, yesterday was check-in, weigh-in measurements with my coach. I check in with her about once every week to two weeks. And I knew going into this that it was not going to be my best. I just knew it. I, it. When I get super stressed, I tend to eat. And unfortunately, life is really kicking my butt right now. And I've been extremely stressed out. And it's, it completely showed. Um, so it was a very disappointing way in. And um, I really think that I need to take the next like week to two weeks to re-evaluate my why. Like I, that's one of the things that I feel like in a weight loss journey, you have to have a why. Why are you doing this? What is your reason? Because I feel like that drives you and that, it, you know, if you keep that in the back of your mind, like that's what's gonna keep you going and be like, okay, I'm doing it because of this, you know? I'm doing it because of my kids. I'm doing it because I wanna fit in those jeans. I'm doing it because I wanna look good. I'm doing it because I wanna impress that guy slash girl, you know? Like, I, you have to have a why. And I feel like somewhere along the way, I completely lost it. I I lost why I'm even doing it. Um, on the fitness side of things, I'm doing really, really well. But as my coach said, abs are made in the kitchen and I need to freaking figure out what the hell I'm doing in the kitchen because right now it's just not going well. So that is that. Tomorrow begins the CrossFit Open. Tonight was the official announcement of 18.1, which is the first of five workouts. Um, so there's a workout every week for the next five weeks and they make the announcement of the workout on Thursdays and then you have until the following Monday to submit your score. Uh, if you don't know what the CrossFit Open is, it is a worldwide uh, CrossFit competition and it's online and the, on Thursdays they announce the workout and you have to either video submit your workout or have um, you know have uh, somebody like certified judge you and so um, every Friday our our box is doing Friday night lights where we participate uh, in the open in the workout and get judged so we can submit our scores but I wanted to tell you guys what the workout is. So I just got home um, from working out and from uh, watching the announcement at at, uh, at my CrossFit gym. I have to say, like, I was nervous going like going into today and like going into the announcement because you have no idea, like, absolutely no idea, like, what workout it's going to be. But I I have to tell you now that I know the workout, like, I am even more nervous because it really focuses on some weaknesses of mine. So 18.1 is complete as many rounds as possible in 20 minutes. So this is a 20 minute workout. Could you imagine? And like, I know, you know, like I know you're like, ah, oh, 20 minutes, but can you imagine working out solid, like high intensity for 20 minutes straight? Yeah, it's long. Uh, so you do eight hanging knee raises now I do scaled if you're which basically means like 
RX is as prescribed. It is how they, um, you know, how they list it. RX is toes to bar. I cannot do toes to bar. I can barely do hanging knee raises, but it is eight hanging knee raises, 10 dumbbell hang, clean, and jerks. And that's basically, uh, you clean, you clean the dumbbell uh, to your shoulder and then you dip and drive uh, the dumbbell up. And it is a 20 pound dumbbell. RX is 30, um, but I'm doing 20 pounds which I'm gonna be honest and say that normally I do like 10 to 15. I know I can do 20 pounds, um, but it's gonna be challenging. And then a 12 calorie row on the rower and you just cycle through those three things until the 20 minutes is up. And your score is how many, uh, how many rounds you got. So, uh, so that's 18.1. And I'm gonna be honest and say that I am extremely nervous but I'm excited. I'm excited to challenge myself. I'm excited to push myself. I feel like the energy um, of people around me that are doing the same workout, I feel like that's going to like, I feel like I'm going to perform a little bit better than I expect. At least I hope so. So I definitely am going to keep you guys kind of in the loop as to what's going on um, with that. CrossFit Open starts tomorrow. I'm excited slash nervous. If you guys want to kind of keep up with uh, with what's going on with me and all of that, definitely follow me on Instagram. I will be posting every Friday um, about my workouts. Hi, Scouty. Um, I will be posting about my workouts. So follow me on Instagram. It's down below. And thank you guys so much for watching. Hi. Hi. Yeah. I will, <laughs> I will talk to you guys later. Say hi. No. Okay.